With more than 2,000 volunteers answering the call for help, last week's return of the Summer Games to Missoula for the first time in a decade was one for the scrapbooks. It uh, was an extraordinary game for a first year in a new location uh, uh, among a group of dedicated volunteers uh, who has been involved organizing these games for the last 12 months. I thought they did a simply fantastic job. Um, uh, it, uh, it rivals anything I've seen in my 23 years um, for a first year effort. The games drew athletes, families, and coaches from every corner of the Treasure State for a week of accomplishment and celebration. And while there were a few minor bumps, organizers say that's to be expected because of the complexity of the event. You know, when you consider these games being multi-day, multi-faceted, volunteer-driven, I don't think there's anything as large as this in our state that occurs. And it wasn't just the Missoula volunteers doing a great job. Norby tells me Missoula venues were perfect. Even though we have a playbook and we kind of work our way through that, uh, the footprint in a new location always has interesting and different nuances. Um, and so what was learned will be the basis for taking a good thing and making it better in years two and three. Beyond the event, it was the individual moments that impressed our MTN team the most, such as seeing Kalen Forsyth of Bozeman, his heroic effort to finish the 100-meter walk, with volunteers coming out to cheer him every inch of the way, the perfect example of the Special Olympic spirit. This is my moment, I've got all that I need, there's a heart of a champion in me. In Missoula, Dennis Bragg, MTN News.